Hi guys, Chris Ignato here again, and uh, you gotta check out this awesome weevil. That is an awesome weevil. How cool is that? And his antenna are actually coming off. His proboscis. I don't know if you guys have ever harvested acorns or not before, but if you have, you may have noticed at times little grubs inside the acorns themselves. Well, those are none other than the famous acorn weevil. Check it out. Now, you notice that it has a very long snout, very long nose. Well, that's not its mouth. That's not really its proboscis, as far as I know, because there's antenna coming out of it. However, at the very end of that snout is the tiny little mouth. Well, it uses the tiny little mouth at the end of that snout to drill its way into the acorn. And it sucks up those fatty oils inside and uses it for wonderful nutrition. But that's not all. It'll lay its eggs inside that acorn. And after time, once the acorn falls on the ground, those grubs will be large enough to bore their way out of the acorn. It takes them some time. Then they spend a long time underground, developing. Eventually they'll emerge as a fully developed acorn weevil. But isn't that the coolest looking thing? I'm pretty sure shrews and moles love to feed on the acorn weevil grubs. So that means they've got at least some predators keeping them in check. But the mighty oak has several things to worry about. There's all sorts of insects and fungi that prey on the tree itself. There's squirrels that love to eat the acorns, humans of course, plenty of other animals. And then you have the acorn weevils. But the tree does produce hundreds and sometimes thousands of acorns to try to keep things in check. So, uh, good luck oak tree and thanks a lot Mr. Weevil. Okay, isn't that the cutest little thing? Anyhow, thanks a lot for watching guys. Chris Ignato, signing out.